am I moving or do you hear me at all? Or am I from on your end? Oh, there you go. Could you guys hear me at all? Yeah. I could hear you, but then it was frozen on a very flattering. It was just like a smile. It was just like. Yeah. It was good. Oh. Because like, you guys sound like. <laughs> and then I'm like. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. And then I was like, I wonder if I'm just stuck, like, you know. <laughs> I'm sorry. Whatever. If I just don't talk, it's because I, I don't know. This is not good for our dynamic where we all talk at the same time. Because doesn't it just, like, let, what is it, like, two or one person talk at once? We need to talk at once. It's going to be hard. Um, we posted on, um, Instagram and Facebook. No, I'm not doing it right. Take two. <laughs> Take two. Okay. <laughs> Clap your head. That's how you slate. <laughs> Take three. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Scratching Post Zoom edition. So we posted on Facebook and Instagram if anybody had any questions and uh, we got some really really interesting ones so ready for it mm -hmm. okay. how did the swing kittens originate who wants to tell it very Nicole <laughs> it froze upon me <laughs> that's once good. upon a time we met in high school <laughs> that's <laughs> The end. That's the end. <laughs> we met in high school, and then uh, I was singing band in high school, big band. And then the leader was like, "Hey, do you know anyone, any other girls that could do like an Andrew Sisters kind of thing?" And I was like, "Yeah." And so I. Carrera, because we were friends and we were in the same grade, and she said yes. And so then I didn't really have anybody else in mind, so then we sang with another girl named Sarah, and she was in the group for like, oh gosh, what do you think, six months, something like that? And then Sarah went off to college, and then we had Brittany, and then Brittany was in the group for like three months, but then she moved and got married, and then we had Lily, and Lily was in the group for like a year and a half, but then she wanted to pursue acting, so she quit, and then uh, Kaylee joined after that, and she's been in the group since 2011, and yes, that's how it started. And the rest is history. And how old was Kaylee in 2011? <laughs> 17. Oh. What is your favorite song to perform as a trio? Ooh. Ooh, I don't know. If it's nerve-wracking, Old Devil Old Devil. Moon. Yeah. Obviously, to be scared, that's plenty. Right? That's just yeah. classic. Yeah. <laughs> we haven't done our songs in so long. I can't remember what they even are. Oh. <laughs> I really like uh, Lollipop is good. Which one, do you, which one do you like, Kaylee? It keeps freezing, so I don't know. <laughs> if you guys heard what I said. <laughs> Did you say Lollipop? No. Absolutely not. I did not say lollipop. Then, yeah, we said the same thing. We said lollipop. We all like no more a lot, I feel like. True. Yeah. Very true. I don't like lollipop. No. Okay. Yes. Um, and then, oh, and then the second part to that is which song do you each like to perform solo? Well, this is a rock one, but I really like Give Me Some Lovin'. That's Because it's long and... But it's it's good, and I like the background parts too. So that's that's a fun one. I like choosing my favorite ones for you guys more than I like choosing my favorite ones for me. Okay, let's do that. Okay. okay. I like when Kaylee sings "I Want You Back" because that's just great. Yeah. It's always great. But I also like um, "Goody Goody." That's kind of a new cool one. Oh, mm -hmm. it's a little spooky. Yeah, I like that. Um, and then for Nicole, I like. Um, um, it could happen to you. That's my favorite. Uh huh. Yeah, that's good. I like all Pereira's top forty songs. They're all jams. 
Moni, moni. You know? Yeah. Give me some love and a moni moni. I'm like, yeah. I will always like when Nicole sings. I'm so excited. Mm. I like Nicole on everything Stevie Wonder. I'm like, thank you. Oh, yeah. I like when Kaylee sings uh, folk songs. <laughs> me too. It's just like Irish folk songs just sound so right. And she. Hey, yep, that's me. What is your favorite cocktail at the moment? Penicillin. Mm -hmm. I also like a nice um, Irish mule, like whiskey mule. Ooh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I think I just like a gin and tonic, and then with grapefruit to make it peppery. Whoa. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nicole. Oh, gosh, I guess a uh, dirty martini, and I, I kind of uh, whiskey sours. I've been, I like that too, but I haven't had one in ages, nor have I had a dirty martini in ages. First celebrity crush, Johnny Depp. Really? Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> yep, Captain Jack Sparrow, one hundred percent. Also, mm -hmm. um, Wesley from Princess Bride. Me and my cousin Lisa were both oh. with him for a minute. <laughs> yeah, that was a good choice. I think my first is Jonathan Taylor Thomas. Really? Pretty yeah. Cool. And then Leonardo DiCaprio. And then immediately into JC Chazé. Well, how do you say it? JC Chaz? Whatever, NSYNC JC. What about you, Nicole? Aaron Carter. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Before Nick Carter? Did you like him more than. Oh. That was my first and only, kind of. <laughs> He's my, last, he's my current crush, too. <laughs> no, now it's Robert Downey Jr. Oh. Oh, current crush? Mm. Oh, I know who my current celebrity crush is, and it's, I don't know his real name in real life, but Jamie from Outlander. Oh, my yeah. God, that's my real crush. I wish, oh, you know what? I can totally screen share it. Oh, screen share it. Sec. My current crush is our our governor, Gavin Newsom. Wait. He's so handsome. I, every time he, and he's doing a good job. Every time I see him speak, I go, oh, Gavin. <laughs> this is Newsom. This picture? Oh, wait, go away. Yeah. This Literally. one? Right, can you guys see yours? That's weird. This one. Yeah, he's weird. He's a politician. His Everything is dyed. His skin is too brown and his teeth are too white, but I'm into it for some reason. This guy. Yeah. Yeah, he's very handsome. Oh, here's a good one. Other than singing, what are your other passions and interests? Read. I love to read. I like, well, I hate writing, but I like to do it for, I, what? And coloring. <laughs> I love to color. I love to buy furniture that I don't need. Just have like 13 side tables in my room that I don't need. But I like like interior design. I like looking at stuff like that, but mostly reading and writing. And cooking f random food. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, eating. That's definitely yeah. my top. I like to cook and bake and paint and plant. I've been planting so much. Nicole? <laughs> <laughs> Everything I like to do is like music related, but I also love eating. I love cats. I love talking. You like to cook. Yeah, you like to cook. You've been cooking a lot. Is and it you've fun? been cleaning a lot. Cleaning, I know. I've become a housewife in like five weeks. Um, what type of pasta are you? Oh, that's such a good question. I hope a Michelle. I feel like Nicole's a bow tie. Here's a good diagram. Wait, for, for the viewers. Oh, so, wow. Ooh, this stuff. Oh. oh my God, these little stuff. What are those? What's conchaloni? Conchaloni. That's like a shell that's messed up. Conch? Is it conch shells or conch shells? It oh. is like a conch. You know, Creste conch. di Gallo has always freaked me out. It kind of looks like a growing, like, sea oh. animal. I think that Pereira is tricolor penne. Okay. Thank you. As long as I'm not fun ghetto. <laughs> What is fun ghetto? Oh, see, those are kind of cool looking. They look like an intestine. That's why I don't want to be it. Can the swing kittens do the get up dance? What's that? 
potentially learn it. We can learn it. Yeah. What is your favorite memory from all of your years together? Um, Here's one that just popped into my brain, so I don't know why it must mean something. And you guys are going to remember, when we were in gosh, Australia? Oh crap, I don't know, one of them. And there was a dance club attached Underneath our hotel, no one was in, and we ended up at that dance club. Uh, gl- glad, glad, Gladstone. Gladstone. Um, I loved all every. So when we'd go on tour, we would go to Indian restaurants all the time, and we would do like our favorite and least favorite parts of the week. Also, throwing every all of our parties for the band. Oh, wine and cheese parties. <laughs> always so fun, and just like going to the store and getting everything, and that was always like the best. I remember us like our first time to Australia going and exploring the state theater for hours like going everywhere and taking pictures of everything. The oh. breakfast buffet in Thailand and we did like an all-nighter. That that's probably the craziest thing we've ever done. Our very first tour ever with people we'd never met before. We had like Chase make us drinks in our like crazy five-star hotel room with the like guys that were there to like help us navigate Thailand and we just hung out with them all night long and went in the pool at like four in the morning. <laughs> Do you remember the, was it the long tour or it had to have been the long tour? We were at the Gold Coast. We stayed up very late. Yes. I don't know if that was when we went to yeah. the, the Irish the club. <laughs> It was a long tour, and, like, the all of the, um, like, Australians got to go home for a week and take a break, but, like, some of the dancers didn't. Like, they got to elect to not and just hang out with us, and so we just got, like, crazy and went, had, like, the best times. There's nothing you could do. You get so, like, heads up after, like, we don't even stay out that late, but for some reason, <laughs> like, two nights over, we're like, we gotta keep staying up. Wow a lot we didn't really answer that question we had a lot of a lot of memories there are probably still more well it's like even hard because then we like have like fourth of july stuff where we've spent the night at hotels too oh even here. i can't even pick i don't even know where to begin or like halloween or something like man coronado remember that <laughs> we've done so many fun things i know very it's lucky crazy a whole japan tour and oh japan. my god i loved it so much Every part of both Japan tours were great. Yeah, yep. it was so much fun. Oh my god! <sighs> what? Well, what's your favorite place you've toured? New Zealand. New Zealand. New Zealand is my favorite. It's 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 so beautiful. Yeah. I love the culture. Like I love, I love how like different it is. I don't know. It, it's, it's very just, like Hawaiian. It's like welcoming and like everyone's family once you're there and they treat you like family. Olive Garden when you're here in your family. Oh, here's a good one. How do you go about picking new material to sing? Um, someone will be like, hey, this new song, or this song sounds really cool. You guys should listen to it. And then another person will be like, oh, yeah, that sounds kind of nice. And then someone else is like, yeah. And then, like, a month later, we, like, we revisit the song, go, yeah, we should do that. And then, like, a couple months after that, <laughs> we get it. <laughs> it's, like, a whole long thing. It's like, a year to and- learn. I just like if it's like a cappella, we can learn it. Bam, you know. Another thing that I think we do is like we'll think about like we need more material for this kind of setting. So we'll be like, we need more stuff that's like a dance tempo, or we need more yeah. stuff like upbeat and fun, or we need more like rock and roll material. So we'll like think of what we need in our set or like to add, and then we'll we'll pick something. Anyway, uh, what is your favorite candy? Mm. Right now, I love Cadbury eggs. Oh, good. Um, I love a Toblerone. Oh, yeah. Mm. Solid choice. Reese's egg or tree? Yeah, Reese's egg. And Twix. Mm. I love Twix. 
so much. I don't know. I don't really know many candies I don't like. What? How do we decide what outfit to wear? Uh, if we're feeling fat or if we're feeling okay. If we're feeling fat, then anything flowy. If we're not feeling fat, then we probably will still choose flowy. I think it depends on the amount of money you give us. <laughs> more money, more form-fitting. Well, we also choose based on the holidays. That's true. Well, yeah, a lot of times it's holidays or and the season. What the band is wearing. Yeah, what the band is wearing. That's true. Or where we're playing. Because if it's hot, then we think about that. Or if it's cold, we have to think about that. Like Fourth of July, we have to be wise. Well, thanks for submitting your. That was fun. Thank you. Hope you guys are well and happy. <laughs> if you ever think about anything you want to ask us, go ahead and ask us on one of our social media. Yeah. We're at home just like you guys, so if you're ever thinking of anything that you want us to sing or you want us to check out or you want to ask us, go ahead and do it and we will answer or sing it or try to. <laughs> well, until next time, we will see you all later. Bye! Bye! Bye.